you're getting back in with Tony Salam, you'll be looking for revenge in this one, won't you? Definitely. It's all about payback time for me. Catch me on a bit off notice, a bit late notice, and I have a lot of time to train this time, so there's no problem for me. No, everything will be alright. Do you think you've really come on since then, since that defeat? I was, I, I was on it just because it was a bit of short notice and, and I couldn't catch him. But definitely this time, he, there's nowhere to run, there's nowhere to hide. I definitely catch him this time. <laughs> <laughs> Is that the key for you, you know, having the, the six weeks, eight weeks preparation? Obviously, you did, you did fight a lot of fights at short notice, but having the time to prepare, that's the key for you, isn't it? That's the key for me right now. I'm getting a bit of notice right now. So. I'm on it, and I'm on it. <laughs> <laughs> um, you saw that power last time out in that last performance. Um, like you said, at light heavyweight, there's not many people that can match that, is it? Yeah, there's not a lot of people who can match it in light in a way because I've poured like I spoiled a lot of cruiserweight guys and I hurt them a lot. Uh, badly said, light heavyweight guy, they can't go the power, so definitely I'll be going through with light heavyweight division with a clear, clear victory. It's not long now till you qualify as a British citizen as well. Would you be looking to, you know, would that be a big thing for you to fight for the British title somewhere down the line? Well, definitely, because Frank Maloney said it would be a good opportunity for me to have that British title. So I look forward to it to get it and see what goes on from there. And it must be a big deal for you to fight on the undercard of Rendell's fight, you know, your gym mate. Yeah, definitely. I appreciate it, man. It's like, you know, step forward to, to my dream, you know what I'm saying? It's all good.